Now, episode three of Prison School. I know this right here is not my usual opening, but this episode almost left me speechless with all the stuff that went on. We had a ton of comedy. We had some pretty good character development. And I gotta say, Four Eyes, you know, this guy right here, he is the ultimate bro. After what he did in this episode, I can never bag on this guy. I have nothing but respect for what he did. But this episode has so much going on. I do want to make it organized, but at the same time, there are like certain things that I definitely want to cover. And so at the beginning of the episode, we see now that uh, Four Eyes and Kiyoshi, the whole one now is definitely complete and their plans are definitely proceeding nicely. And we see now they were doing a test run where we have Kiyoshi, you know, going outside for the first time since they got locked up. And obviously, you know, he was, he was like picking out, you know, certain things. But then we have the principal who who knew what or, or the chairman who knew what he had to do because obviously his daughter has caught him not once but twice now with his stash of pictures and so right now he had no choice but to get rid of them but we see now that while Kiyoshi was like studying the city we see now that there was like one couple and we have this guy, you know, he, he had his hand all on, on his girl, but, and we see now obviously it was censored, but I do believe that like he had her skirt lifted and obviously, you know, her panties were showing, but he had his hand all up in there and really I can't get mad at him because they are a couple obviously, but this guy was just like going in and we see now that when, when Kiyoshi was like going to turn back, that's when he saw the principal and we see him now burying these pictures because obviously, you know, he has no choice but to get rid of them. But we see now that Kiyoshi here, he could not move to the principal had left and we see that because of that, the bell here, it it, it it had rung and so obviously now he was like running late and so now we see that when the principal, you know, finally left, we have him now making his way back, but the vice president, she had now came there and she was like looking, you know, for Kiyoshi, but she could not find him. And so we see now that while she was uh, walking along, she, uh, she almost came across this hole, but we see now that Four Eyes, he, he had, you know, some kind of trap, you know, that was there so that when she got closer to it, you know, that right there would like mess her up and, and so she had fell. And now we see Kiyoshi, you know, playing the cool and appearing now, trying to uh, help her up. And we see now that for some reason, even though she was like calling him and obviously, you know, getting up, getting mad that he like never responded to her, she did not hit him. But when it came to Four Eyes, you know, she uh, did hit him and tell him, you know, to, uh, to clean that up. So obviously, you know, I'm thinking that maybe, you know, it's possible that the vice president can have or, or does have, you know, a crush on Kiyoshi because there were like certain times where he would like back talk to her, but you know, she like never, you know, hit him except for last week where where we have, you know, that a very comedic scene. I do believe that right there, but like the only time we like ever really saw her, you know, abuse Kiyoshi as much as the other guys. But now we see that while they were all, you know, like at the end of the day, all back in, you know, in their in their cell, you know, having dinner, we see now that once again the uh, vice president has shown up in a completely different attire that a completely, a completely different attire that we had not seen her before. And so we see now all the guys were like going crazy over her, but we see now that she had came here to to give them, you know, their to schedule. And I'm thinking if that right there is the clothes that she wears when she goes to bed, then I'm thinking that like maybe she also lives in the prison with them, but obviously, you know, her cell or she might not have a cell but a room, wherever wherever she sleeps at, it's obviously, you know, much different from uh from what they have. But obviously she like always close by to them. But we see now that when they saw that schedule, we uh do learn that on Saturday they will have some kind of event and, and the boys here will, will like be watching over it and we have Kiyoshi, Four Eyes, and Shingo on like on uh on one activity and the other two doing you know different things and so we see now that with that that with uh Shingo now in the picture obviously that right there definitely kind of like ruined their plan a bit but we have Kiyoshi here that what that was like thinking about bringing him in so that way you know he would know about what they were uh, going to do and so we see now that uh 
And we see now that the Shingo, he had went to go take off some trash, but he can overhear them talking. And so right now, this guy was obviously, you know, mis misunderstanding everything they were saying. But to me, I was like dying because he was like getting the uh, the, the wrong idea. And we see now later on that day, when, when they were all taking a bath, we, we have uh, Four Eyes dropping his soap. And we have, you know, we have him picking it up in front of Kiyoshi. And so we see now Shingo here, he, he was still trying to sort out, you know what they were saying but obviously now it was like definitely thrown off his uh, his mind game and so we see now that when, when he uh opened the uh opened the shower door and saw them obviously it looked wrong to him and to make things worse we have four wives here now falling you know right in front of you know of a kiyoshi and that right there definitely missing like they were doing something you know very inappropriate and we see now that you know shingo's face and i love the way they, they animate this because to me it's just so freaking priceless and so now we see that and so now we see that you know when he uh when that now we see that you know obviously he has he has the wrong idea and the next day now when and the next day when when uh, Kiyoshi and Four Eyes are like figuring out what they need to do we uh we we see that while Kiyoshi here was like in the bathroom he actually did find a way you know to sneak out and that right there was to use the uh, underfloor plumbing system. And so now we see that, you know, like now we then see that once him and Four Eyes knew about this and Kyochi was like making his way back, we see now that uh that Shingo, he was like running his big mouth and he told Andre and Joe, you know, what what he thought he saw them doing and obviously, you know, and then so, so now now we have all three of them thinking that like Kyoshi and Four are like secret lovers and we see now that eventually the uh, vice president, she had came there and we see that obviously, you know, Kyoshi can see what was going on and he had the uh, perfect sight of her butt and her panties and so we see now you know Kyoshi was like you know like watching her and we see you know for some reason you know she had decided she had uh, decided to, to uh, do some squats you know right there and Kyoshi you know had the uh, perfect view but obviously he could not get distracted because you know there was a huge chance you know he he would get caught and we see now that the uh, vice president almost slipped on her own sweat and that right there calls her heel you know to uh go inside this hole and actually impale kiyoshi and when i saw that i felt so bad for the guy but of course i i could not help but laugh but now we see you know uh now see at, at the end of the day we have Kyoshi here trying to uh, make up some excuse as to why he was he was in the bathroom for so long, and we see now that uh, and we see that obviously his lie did not work because Shingo here did write him out. But we see that the reason why Shingo did that is because you know they all saw you know all that blood, and Shingo you know told her that he had hemorrhoids, and to me that right there was, was like even more funny because obviously like I said this whole episode you know pretty much focused around one huge misunderstanding but now we see that obviously you know because because of that at, at least you know from how creepy you know uh shingo thought uh four eyes and kiyoshi was he was like able to get out, 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 out of uh, working with them you know on, on that event and that way at least they can now focus you know on making their break and we see now that at the following night, you know, all of them, all of them have requested, you know, some kind of item, you know, to, to be bought there for them. And we see now that four wives have wanted, you know, a recording device. And so we see that the next day, because they had no choice but to have a computer class with the girl, because obviously, you know, they, they, they don't have enough, you know, to bring there for the boys. But obviously, you know, they, they were, they were, they were cut off in, in their own area. But now we see that because of that, you know, uh, Joe, I mean, not, not Joe, Four Eyes, he was actually going to record, you know, some pooping sound, you know, on that recorder. So that way they can use that. So, so that whenever, you know, the uh, vice president or anyone would like get too close, you know, to the bathroom when uh, Kyoshi was out, they would hear that. But, you know, but not surprisingly enough. Four Eyes could not find anything, and so he made the ultimate choice that they had to make the uh, the sound themselves. And so we see now that you know Four Eyes. I, I felt so bad for him when he did this. He actually went to the bathroom on himself, and I was just blown away that he did that. I never would have thought that he would have took it that seriously. But obviously, you know, when he did that, 
All the girls were disgusted, and even the guys were, like, shocked. But now we have Kiyoshi, you know, just so determined, you know, to actually break out with him. But once again, we uh, go to the president or, or the chairman, who we see is, like, such a weak man that he actually, you know, dug up the picture that he buried. But now, once again, he has to make sure that, like, this time, you know, he had, uh, this time they stay buried, and he's going to get them out so easily. But now we see that, you know... Now, now we see that at the, uh, or, or they don't end that day, actually, where we have, you know, all, all the, uh, guys together with my president, they were just, like, bagging on him because of what he did, and even though, you know, he was, like, you know, prepared for this, he definitely, you know, was not as much as he thought, because obviously, you know, it was good to him, and Kiyoshi was the only one who knew why he did that, but now we see that while they were all working together, we have the, uh, we have the chairman this time burning his pictures with cement and, 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 and we, and we see now that he, he was the first one who noticed, you know, that hole. And now we see that when Kiyoshi had went to check it, obviously, you know, it was now covered because this guy definitely does not want his school, you know, to uh, fall to pieces. And so right now their plan is like a definite bust. And so we see that, you know, Four Eyes, he was like definitely depressed about this. And of course he put all the blame on Kiyoshi because he was the one that was supposed to, you know, check the hole regularly. Wow, you know, for a while I thought of all the plans to keep everyone away from it. And so, uh, so I definitely see where Forrest was like coming from, especially after all, you know, he had went through. So obviously, you know, he had every right to be upset. And we even see now that at dinner that night, obviously, you know, this guy was like so freaking pissed off. He almost, you know, ran out Kyoshi with, with, with how much he was yelling. And we see, you know, like as usual, these three guys still have no idea, you know, what's like really going on. But because of that, you know, uh, four eyes, he, he was like definitely in the slump, but we see that Kiyoshi, he will not give up because he actually had a plan where like he will like dress as a girl and that, and that way, you know, he could sneak out. But now they have to like lay low because, you know, uh, Kiyoshi here has to wait for that laundry company to actually come in and get the clothes so that way he can steal a uniform. But we see that for some reason. Uh, for us, you know, even though, even though they had three days left, he, he was just, you know, like, like, like putting out all the stops here because we see that, you know, at the, uh, during, during the next day where we have the, uh, vice president, you know, hitting him, we, we, we see now that, uh, that, uh, she had knocked him down and when he stood up, you know, he had, he had his face all in her panties and not only that, when she like pulled him up by his hair and when she let him go, he fell face first into her chest and for some reason he thought, you know, that right there was not enough because obviously, you know, he thinking that he had to do a lot more than that. And so, and so we see now that the, uh, that the president, she was, she was there herself. And so we see, you know, him, but, you know, playing a fool, but obviously he definitely knew what he was doing because we see now that when the vice president, you know, tried to hit him, we, we see him now dodging her easily. And not only that, he, he had did, you know, some kind of bl uh, black, back flip or back jump, whatever, whatever you want to call it, and grabbed the uh, president's skirt and pulled it down. And now we see her now in awe. And that right there is where the, you know, episode ended. And to me, that right there was awesome and hilarious at the same time. But like I said, this, 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 uh, this, this episode, it was definitely good. I liked it. Like, to me, I felt like there could have been a little bit more progression, you know, in the episode because... You know, we uh we still have three days left, and I felt like you know at this point it should be you know one day left, so that way you know we can finally see how it goes next week. Well, overall, it was definitely a good episode, and so with that, I'm going to give it probably a seven out of ten. And of course, I'd love to hear your thoughts on this. And as always, don't forget to like and subscribe. Please let me out, and you guys take it easy. I will see you all next time.